thousand years ago, it was only the kings and queens that could do anything on a national or regional level. A hundred years ago, it was the industrialists, the robber barons. Today, any of us who are really, truly passionate right. can access the world's information on Google, you know, the infinite computing on the cloud. Right. It's, it's, it's amazing. Quarter. Mike. So what would your advice be to someone sitting out there now in a doctoral program at MIT or a college senior at Caltech or any place actually? They read in the newspapers worldwide that there's a tremendous lack of pure water, like sure. say in Africa. Yeah. How do you be bold enough to put together an enterprise? Great, to great question. And uh, so one of the organizations I run is called Singularity University. and We, we source uh, thousands of grad students around the world and we come to Silicon Valley, and we teach them about uh, exponential technologies, uh, mindsets, access to crowdfunding, crowd tools. We say the world's biggest problems, clean water, yeah. food, energy, are the world's biggest business opportunities. And it's truly this alignment and that, you know, if you want to become a billionaire, help a billion people. So it's, if you go after a small problem, you're capped. If you go after a problem that affects a billion people, you've got the ability to truly impact the world in an extraordinary fashion, make a difference, and make great wealth. Peter,